Hi, Nick Droback with part four of Field and Stream's bow setup series. And today we're going to show you how to properly set, tie, and secure a string loop on your bow. There are several ways to tie a D loop or string loop. I'm going to show you the way that works best for me. When burning the ends of your D loop, make sure that you flare the material out before burning it to leave a large amount of material at the very end. That will ensure that the D loop doesn't slip through your knot. Once you have your material cut and burned, leave that loose. Don't tighten the D-loop down quite yet. We're going to need to get it adjusted to match your cam system to get you the best arrow travel possible. In some cases, you might need to leave it a little knock high for single cams and other hybrid cam systems. For binary and overdrive binary cam systems, you have perfectly level knock travel, so keep it straight. For the cam system we're working on, we have level knock travel. So I'm going to go ahead and cinch it down right here. There are several tools on the market to help you tighten a D-loop. This is the one that I chose. Now that our D-loop is set and in place, it's time for the next step. We're going to align our sight with our string on the next segment. 